funny, isn't it? You think your day is going great when somebody suddenly ruins it with one comment and you suddenly turn. Your head fills with angry thoughts and realizations, then BAM! I grew up close to my family and consider them more than just my parents. They are my friends, my best friends. My parents themselves are atheists, but my decision wasn't because of them. I made my own decisions based on life experiences and my own thoughts. I've often prepared myself for some interesting and controversial conversations with my friends, but nothing prepared me for this particular day's events. My Walking to the lecture that day was just as normal as every other day, and the conversations about what Tony was... Working by Saturday and Sunday made my weekend naff. Before I could explain how well my Christmas shopping went this weekend, Jenny... You're an atheist, you don't celebrate Christmas. I'm sorry, but did you just say what I think you said? You're telling me I shouldn't be able to celebrate Christmas? Jenny, the devout Christian, the one who is supposed to be very forgiving and all open arms, then gave me some kind of confused look as if I shouldn't have reacted in this manner, and that I should have just accepted what she had said. Of course she had something to say and launched her voice at me with a passion. It's the birth of Christ! Blah, 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 blah. Again, I was awestruck in bemusement. A friend who I once thought was kind and respectable judges me by my beliefs and preaches to me that I am not allowed to do as I want. I turned to Gary, the agnostic. I barely opened my mouth when... You know I'm right and that's the end of the argument. <coughs> Beaten down and trying to fight against what seemed to be the grain, I decided to give up and not speak of this issue for a while. couldn't just let yesterday drop. They may have opinions and points of view which may have some value to me, but it's about what I felt from the heart. I need to take on the problem myself and I need to set the record straight. The scene was set. We all knew there were things that needed to be said. Some conscious walls of defence that was put up and everyone was avoiding the normal chit chat just in case the issue was brought up again. But all it took was... Only a couple of weeks left till Christmas now, mate. This set off Jenny with her patronising... Well, only for some it should be. Okay, I get it, Jenny. I may not be a Christian, and I may not be religious in any way. And I know that Christmas is a Christian holiday, but I'm still allowed to celebrate it. At this very point in time, I could let Jenny go on about religion and this and that, and how I shouldn't celebrate Christmas, and blah, 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 blah. At this time of year, I celebrate with my family, whether it be in my own house, or my aunties, or my grandparents. It doesn't matter as long as we're all together. And it's the only time of year when we get to see each other without the interruptions of work or education. It shouldn't be just about the presence, and it's not singularly about the religion. It's about family and being with each other at this time of year. You can't tell me you don't enjoy seeing your family at this time. Silence. Religious in any way, and Christmas may be a group. Okay, wait. I'm recording now. <laughs> <laughs> Only a few weeks now. <laughs> <laughs>